What's up everybody? Today we're gonna play a challenge called Couples 1, 2, 3 Tag. That's what the name of it is. Close right? enough, yeah. So what happens is, she's gonna ask me a question, and on a count of three, we both blurt out the answer, and hopefully, my good girlfriend knows me and gets the answer right. I ain't even gonna trip, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna do any of that stuff, cause you're so wishy-washy, I don't even know if you know what you like. I'm wishy-washy? I'm not wishy-washy at all. So if I get it wrong, it's because you're wishy-washy. No, I am not wishy-washy at all. I know what I like, and I've been liking it since I was like two years old. All right, we'll see. What? All right, ready? Mm -hmm. So, if you could be married to a movie star, who would it be? Oh, I don't know her name. All right, I got it. Oh, I don't know her name. You better figure it out. You ready? Uh, yes. You, you know the name now? No. Then what are you gonna say? You're gonna scream out some nonsense and yeah, get it wrong? Yeah. You're gonna immediately get the no, first answer wrong? No, I'm gonna try wrong? to get, no. <laughs> I'm gonna try to go like, like get the actual things that she does. Okay, ready? Fine. One, two, three. Victoria Natalie Portman! Saw. Shit, what? You got it wrong already, the I first I had no answer. idea. Natalie Portman, really? Hell yeah. You've never once me mentioned Natalie Portman, ever. You've mentioned the Victoria's Secret model. Which one? There's, what do you mean the Victoria's Secret? There's 20,000 of them. The one, the, name the one that you like. Alessandro Ambrosio. That's the one. Come on, I don't even know what you're trying to ask. Okay, Alessandro Ambrosio, she's really pretty. So you named obviously. her? Obviously, yes, I've named her. But the reason why I like Natalie Portman Well, is wait a minute, no, I'm trying to get to, to why I was, I'm even surprised because you're wishy-washy ass has never talked about Natalie Portman. The other one I know is that old lady that you like, that married the old, the older guy. Why would I like an old lady? You know, she's not really old, but the the one that you're like, she's like really elegant. Not Uma Meryl Thurman. Streep? No, what, have you ever talked about Meryl Streep? No. Catherine Zeta-Jones. Oh, Catherine Zeta-Jones is a good you one. You see, you stupid fool. Fine, Catherine Zeta-Jones is a good one. You've mentioned her, you even mentioned Uma Thurman. I've also mentioned Alicia Keys too. Yeah, but, okay, so in this conversation, you never once mentioned to me Natalie Portman, ever. Well, I just thought of her right now, okay? Dude, this is not how you play the game. It's okay, not fine. that we know. You don't well, just think of it on well, the spot. You should, you should, all right, well, the reason why so I like... So, did I get it wrong? Yes! Why? You just because, thought about yeah, it on the, the spot. Because the Victoria's... Okay, if it was the girls we have talked about, you should have said Catherine Zeta-Jones or Alicia Keys. No, you always talk about Andrea Ambrosio or whatever. Yeah, but those are just girls that are hot. I, I like know, girls with always, substance. But you always talk about her, so I'm like, oh, okay, so obviously he has the hots for her, so I'm gonna no, say No, it's her. just because they're hot. Out of the Victoria's Secret models, yes, the hot ones is Alessandra Ambrosio and uh, what's the other girl? And uh, No, there's one other girl you named. Me? No, I don't know any Oh, uh, well, there's another girl that's hot, too. They're, those two are the famous ones, but Giselle, oh, but Giselle Bündchen is the one that I would marry because why? She's the number one top ranking model in terms of earnings a year. She runs her own empire, and she has the best brand deals. So I need a girl with substance, and that is why I like Natalie Portman because, number one, she's really pretty. Number two... But you've she, never talked about her, so there's no way I could two, guess that. Number two, she kills it on the fucking acting. She's a great actress, Academy Award winning ever since she was a kid. Number what was the movie that she was in a kid? What's that I don't remember, but I, just, I watched the oh. trailer. No, no, I actually watched the audition tape for that, and I was like, damn, as a kid, you're that good? Fine. And number three, she went to Harvard. Yeah, well, to my surprise, your wishy-washy ass just thought about it on the spot, so I'm giving myself that point. I don't lose. Well, you didn't even say Catherine Zeta-Jones or Alicia Keys. No, but come on. I did say one of the girls that you always talk about. Yes, but that was one that I thought was hot and doesn't even have substance. I didn't know that. I don't know. You know that I like girls with substance. I do know that. Because you definitely why don't have the looks. Yeah. That's <gasps> why I got with you. That is horrible. Fine, go to the next question. You're so mean. You gotta make it up to me. Alright, I love you. Nah, don't touch See, me. I told you. I see? You. See? Alright, next question. Later. Oh, you promised. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, okay. If, if you could be any celebrity, who would you be? I already know. Oh, you fuck. know? <laughs> then I don't you know. You know? I think you're gonna get this one wrong. Probably then. I think it's between um, one, two people. Celebrity, okay? Okay. Ready? Yep. One, two, three. The Jimmy Rock! Jimmy Fox! What? <laughs> the Rock? Why would I want to be The Rock? What was the other person? Christian Bale. Christian Bale? Who's yeah, Christian Bale? Christian Bale. 
Bail. Yeah, that's what I said. You said question bail. There was spit coming out of my mouth and I was trying to hold it. That is not even number two. I don't know. Oh my goodness. But you don't even Jamie know Jamie Foxx is a good one. Who no. would have been after? Will Smith. Really? Yes. What the fuck? Wow, I'm learning so much about you today. Oh, you don't even, you know that I highly admire. I do know that. Multi-talented people. I do know so that. So Jamie Foxx, Academy Award winning actor. Started off as a comedian on In Living Color, which is a killed crazy it. ass mad TV show. Yeah, and he killed it. And he fucking sings like a mofo. Like a mofo. And he stays out the motherfucking tabloids. Yup, and he dances like a mofo too. Same thing with Will Smith. Start off as a rapper, Grammy Award winning rapper. Some of you guys might even know that his Fresh Prince TV show was based off of his Grammy Award winning album. And it was based off, loosely based on his life. Yeah. And then he had the TV show, Fresh Prince, and then actor. And then production producer producer company. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. And that even one. his kids are killing it. Well, I thought The Rock because he's like he kind of like went through his trials and tribulations, but he stays out of the tabloids. Like he started he off does. in wrestling and he's like a family's guy, like a family man and like he's like wholesome. I don't know. I just he hard he wor he's hard working. I don't know. That's where my I mean, he's went. buff. He's, he's kind of like me. I mean, I, I see where you get where you're going with this. I see where you're going with this, but... Wait, I don't know what you're trying to do. I'll take that as a compliment. Yeah, okay, fine. So do I get that point? No. Fuck. You got two wrong already. All right. You're a horrible. One wrong! One! Because Natalie Portman doesn't count. Say it. I only got one wrong. Fine, you got one wrong. Okay, fine, thank you. Wrong. No, one. Okay, so, um, you've gone... You've gone to 7-Eleven to get milk and decided that you wanted to buy me a treat. Buy you a treat? Okay. Yeah, you need to buy me a treat. Okay. You got your milk, you got your essentials out of the way. Okay. Now you're like, oh, you know what? My poor mama bear, I know she's gonna get really happy when I buy her something to eat. Okay, okay. What would I buy her? Okay. All right, what are you gonna buy me? Ready? Yep. One, two, two three, gummy bears! bears! Yes! <laughs> Wait, what the hell? That means I get an extra point. So I added, I added to my score of knowing you. Yeah, well, in my video, I got a point for you too, okay? So fine. we're even. Okay, fine. So whatever your face. I know you love gummy bears. Ever since we started dating, you've, oh been, you've been a gummy bear for that. You know how much she loves gummy bears? We'll eat a normal fucking meal, right? And she'll be like, oh, I'm so fucking full. This is before macros, so don't even try to use that excuse. Oh, I'm so, so full. Oh my God. And we're in the car. Oh, can't eat anything else. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell are you doing? I, I always I'm, got room for gummy bears. Yeah, I always save enough room for gummy bears. What the hell? Gummy bears don't take up any part of your room. I mean, <laughs> room. room in your stomach. Yeah, it does it because it belongs to the trash can. <laughs> no, they're amazing and they bring color to my world. Mm -hmm. I love them. When you make me sad, gummy bears are always there to make me happy. Fine. Good job, though. That wasn't hard. Anyone knows that. All right, what percentage of housework would you say that I think I do? Okay. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. 90! That was yes! close! <laughs> I knew you were gonna say a lie and say something like 90 to 100. I knew it. No. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> so why would I say that? Because you think you do a lot, but, so th this is, th you're a double-edged sword. You know why? Because I'm yes, you clean a lot. Awesome no, I because you clean a lot, but you also cause the most shit. So most of the times, you think you're cleaning the house, but you're just cleaning out after yourself. <laughs> Not true. Yes. All Not the, true. All the I have candles. a picture. I have a picture of this fool. He does this shit to me all the time, and it freaking irritates the shit out of me. Right. So he. Shut up. So he gets cereal, right? He loves cereal. He loves eating cereal. Like, I think he's gonna eat that even if he doesn't have fucking teeth in his mouth. So he loves cereal. But what he does is, so there's a bag, right? Inside of this bottle, there's a bag that holds the cereal. He finishes it, but if there's like less than like a quarter of it left, he rolls up the bag, puts it back into the box because he says, I'm gonna eat that later. Why when I was cleaning, there's two boxes that he did that to? Well, guess what? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's still put back where it belongs. Your shit that is, is annoying. all over the place. No, we That's have a shoe rack true. and That's your not... shoes are all over the place. Why are you always asking me for tweezers, for fucking nail clippers, for all of that shit? Because you never know where are, any of it is. Because you're in charge of those things. Those aren't even mine. Those are yours. Because you're in charge of my things. Oh, because why? But your clothes, you never put stuff your clothes away. belong on hangers, but where are they? No. They're on the desk, they're on no. the freaking dresser. That's all you. Over the place. Me. You like to take your clothes off with the hangers still on it because you travel with it. Yeah. I don't remove my hangers 
no, no, I'm saying so many clothes. Your clothes, yeah, they're all over the place no, except on, on the hangers. No, they're not. So you're usually just cleaning up no, after yourself. No, 100% right here. Because no. I mean, he has like no chores at home. You're you always. You literally have no. And I I've said this chores. in both of I shouldn't have chores. Yo, shut up. I'm the man. Whatever, whatever. You fucking better man up and Fuck. do some. Shut up. Anyway, so his only chores are picking up dog shit and taking out the trash. Taking and out I the take trash. trash. I've been killing that. Every Tuesday night, I pull that motherfucker out for Wednesday morning. Whatever. It's about 60 40, because 40% of the time, our neighbor's taking it out, okay? No, 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 no. Whatever. And I'm still doing the fucking shit dog picking up him, okay? I give you that. Fine. If I could choose one thing for you to get rid of, what would it be? 